We obviously surgery, like everything else, has, has also uh, been refined over the past uh, two decades. Really, uh, this is not the same cystectomy as it was before. We have enhanced recovery after surgery programs get the patients out sooner. We we have really honed in on the potential complications after surgery, and to some degree are making a difference in in trying to reduce those. Now, many of them are patient factors that are not alterable, not modifiable. Uh, the you know long smoking history, cardiac disease, those things we can't really modify. Uh, as much as we can with uh, perioperative nutrition. There's some nutrition studies ongoing right now to see whether we can decrease infection rates. Uh, so those are exciting, but those those changes are incremental. They're, they're uh, slow incremental changes. The, the, the surgery still remains a complex operation. Uh, survivorship issues include um, in managing or dealing with uh, urinary diversion. Uh, and, and, and how to manage those, how to choose those. This is a decades-long question for patients of you know which diversion choice is best for me. And we continue to um, refine those questions, refine the answers to those, and see who is a candidate for orthotopic neal bladders and who's really not a good candidate for that. Um, look at the complication rates. How, how can we uh, prevent those complications? Uh, one of the more exciting things in women, uh, for instance, we, we should uh, a radical system in women always used to be an anterior pelvic exenteration, uh, removing the, the bladder, the uterus, the ovaries, tubes, and ovaries. And now we're refining that. Was that not everybody needs uh, that operation. We can just do a, a female organ preserving surgery, preserve quality of life, sexual function, continence, and all that stuff, and only do a cystectomy in select patients. So we're beginning to see some results, early results for those uh, uh, patients of these female organ preserving uh, surgeries that, that are safe oncologically and functionally we're improving it. In, in male patients, again, some refinements in surgery uh, to, to try to reduce the, the long-term complications of these uh, um, uh, uh, surgeries. It really requires a, a lot of attention, a, lo a lot of nuanced um, attention to the details to, to assure optimal outcome.